So I follow a lot of um, food channels on YouTube, and one of them is uh, the best food review. Hold on, what is it? I'm gonna give you guys the name in case you want to follow it. It's really good. The guy's name is Sunny, the host, and he just goes around to different um, places, like mostly in Asia, and uh, eats a bunch of interesting um, foods and then like reviews it. So it's uh, the show is called Best Ever Food Review Show. And the host, Sonny, um, posted on Instagram, he wrote something very motivational that I thought I would share. And um, so, yeah, I would like to just read him quoting. He said, when I, um, I, and this is, he titled it, The Rule That Saved My Life. So this is the rule that saved his life. When I was 17, my dad cobbled together a beater car for me, a Chrysler LeBaron 88. It sucked, but it worked, so I was happy. In the trunk of that car was a cassette tape voiced by Brian Tracy called The Psychology of Achievement. I don't know who put it there, but I do know I listened to the 12-hour series more than once. One lesson that stuck with me took place near the end of the series. He said, in short, take responsibility for where you are in life right now. Where you are right now is a direct reflection of every thought you've had and every action you've taken up to this point. Stop the cassette. What? For some, that feels like a slap in the face. For me, it was the key to freedom. I've failed a lot in my life, and whenever I messed up in a relationship, when I drank too much, when my, when my weight ballooned up to 300 pounds, when I flunked out of college for the third time, or when I got fired from freaking Applebee's, I always knew deep down that these events were the results of my actions. That meant I could learn from them, and I could do better. This type of ownership can feel incriminating. But once you get past your bruised ego, personal responsibility is where you find absolute freedom. I got myself in this hole. I can get myself out. I was born in this hole. I can get myself out. I can't wait for people to save me. I can get myself out. Throughout my life, the only sinister, shadowy presence behind my destruction was me. This was and still is great news. I have no idea how I'd fight off some unknown external force, but I do know how to look in the mirror. Excuses and blame equals someone else has control over my life. Responsibility equals, I have control over my life. Which one suits you? So I thought that was really great, um, how he worded and put that, you know, from his own personal experience. And it's so very true. And it's um, it's really encouraging if you look at it in the right way and, you know, recognize and realize that, yeah, it's, it's all true. And Nadia from Spartanite also said, um, she said it this way, that every... Um, Everything that has happened in your life up till now is the result of how you've been thinking and your perception, the thoughts you've held, the beliefs you've held, and even, you know, that leads to actions for the past two to three years. So if you change your perception today, then 12 months from now, you'll have a completely ver different uh, version of yourself. So yeah, that's just another another one for you and uh, I don't want to make this video too long I just wanted it to be a little short motivational thing so hope you guys are having a good day